Hi folks, I'm Devin, and not too long ago, some friends and I decided to have a competition where we'd each make bread. But there's a twist. We weren't allowed to use a recipe. That means we basically had to go off of our own intuition and whatever we knew about baking bread at the time. But anyways, please enjoy. Hey folks, so today we are making bread without a recipe. Here, here's the crew. We have bread eater, lady, tall, skinny man, and... The sexiest man alive, Tony, and all of this Andrew too. You eat apples? No, it's Andrew too. Uh, we are. I don't. This is not going to go well at all. I'm going to be documenting this along the pro, along the way, and we'll see how it goes. Don't cut your finger. We're not having. No, no, no. I tried earlier. Really think we would cut our fingers. It's not that sharp. We walked over and came back, and Andrew's holding a machete with a stick of water stuck to it. So. I don't think that's what Andrew. That is that. That was true, though. I'm sorry, but I think your memory is false. Yeah, it was a cleaver. Oh, there's a small difference. Do not throw that. Do not throw yeah, that in the like, It's gonna be a trick. It's gonna, like, no, no, we're like, not. No, 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 no. Lauren, what what is your Where's plan right now? What do I to try and make croissants? Because I already know how to make bread, but I have no idea how to make croissants. All right, so you got the yeast and you got the hot water, right? All right. Alex, what is your I'm making plan? Making a triple braided loaf of bread with seeds. Bread. Bread. Alright, Leo, what is your plan? Are they eating the whole goddamn baguette? Just gonna throw some tools. stuff in a bowl and see what happens. Leo has no idea how to cook. Andrew tried to snort flour with a knife earlier, and I don't know what his plan is. Get high Nothing? Full workouts. Um, Alright, Tony watches Babish, I think, so he I might. What else goes in bread? What is your plan, Tony? Um. Alright, I got like. Maybe a 3 to 1 ratio? <laughs> Alright. And I am gonna make something with olive oil. It's gonna be something like pizza-ish, I guess. Like ciabatta almost. Where's the yeast? That is the yeast right there. How much? We'll see how this goes. And this is where it all started to go downhill. It's been. Wait, wait, no, we're not even five minutes in. Leo's cooking no, his bread. No, seriously, seriously. you might actually be able to do it. Oh, He's cooking his bread. She's getting food. What is he cook? Look, I don't have a bowl. I just. I need more. F I have too much water in it. Wait, wait. Well, you're not gonna be able to get it out. Just put more flour in. Yeah, just add oh more God. flour until it balances out. That's atrocious. What I'm like, what is that? Looks like porridge. Your mom looks like porridge. Oh my God. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, Tony's not too bad. Run bowls in the ovens. Full, this so I is. I, just boil it. I don't understand the boiling process of it. And then over here, we're letting ours bloom. I have a little bit of olive oil in mine because I want to do something like pizza esque, like before. She's doing croissants or something. So. The idea, yeah. It's probably just gonna be. You realize how much it's gonna take, like folding in that butter and stuff? It's gonna take ages to do. Oh, dang, that's what I forgot was my nice, like, rolling thingy. The rolling pin? No, I have, like, a mat you put on the table so you don't get flour everywhere. Oh, that would have been smart, yep. So, now here I made a very grave mistake that would have costed me pretty much the whole competition. If you know anything about baking bread, yeast needs sugar to, you know, do its thing, and I kind of forgot the sugar. Now while that might have been really bad, it's nowhere close to what the other guys made. Thankfully Leo threw out that boiled bread thing, but what he made afterwards was just as bad if not worse. Leo's, where is your dough? Right this is it? This is it. He boiled his, and there's coffee in it, and it's coffee it's browns, coffee beans, coffee beans, beans and liquid coffee. I threw away the boiled one. Oh, yeah, you threw away the boiled one. And he started over. It's looking very dry in there. What was the other one? Isn't it supposed to be? <laughs> um, we'll see, I guess. And then, Lauren, yours isn't in here already. Why don't I just take a peek at it? I mean, I don't want to let the heat out. Oh, yeah, so Lauren's is in there, essentially. Mine is over there. I forgot to put salt in it. That's not good. But we're going to bake it in olive oil, like a focaccia or something. Something like that. I don't know. I love focaccia bread. It's so amazing. Tony, Andrew, and Alex are currently going to get more flour because their doughs are not looking very good. This is Alex's. Very, very sticky. Way too much yeast water. Now let me explain the monstrosity that you're looking at here. Alex had mixed up the water and flour already, but he forgot the yeast. So he put in the yeast afterwards, and it's a very sticky, disgusting mess. Let me tell you what, it gets worse from here. That one mistake he made with doing that, it carries on throughout the whole competition. The final product is terrible. I can get flour right here. Wait, where are you? Yeah. What were you doing? Oh, where's your butt though? Where's your dough? My dough? 
Yeah, is it one of these two? No, oh, that's Tony's. Oh, this is mine. That's yours. Yeah, this is very dry. It's like your cookie from last week. Tell me, wait, uh, is it supposed to be moist? No, it's not supposed to be like dead dry. Like his was like a brick, essentially. Essentially, like, you took his. not a brick. <laughs> I think honestly, Tony's looks the most promising to me. Like, despite him, like it actually looks the texture of it. It's, it's like supple. It's like, not too tacky. Agree, but I just don't see any coffee in there. Mm, that's fair. Leo, where did this go? Right here. God, the coffee thing is gonna be <laughs> terrible. <laughs> it's. I, I'm actually very interested to see how it is. I'm really tired, so I figured I'll well just make bread and coffee. I mean, yeah. So, needless to say, things are looking pretty freaking crazy right now, right? I got my olive oil uh, focaccia thing going on there, messed up there. Lauren's got her croissants, right? They're looking pretty good. They're kind of, I think she should put layers personally. Um, Alex has the whatever, whatever that mess is. Leo's got the very interesting coffee bread that you will definitely see more of, don't worry. Tony's bread isn't too, too, doing too bad either, but Andrew, though. Oh man, Andrew did not like where that was going, so even though he still goes on with it, he kind of wanted to restart, and so he made his new bread, and he really wanted to use the recipe because he actually wanted to do, felt like, I guess, successful in his bread making, so that's what he did, and that's what you, that's what you're about to see here in a second. Andrew, you're going to break it. <laughs> yeah, no, actually, the way I want to see this. So... So, the actual attachment is over here. This is the actual stand mixer ball. Leo's using it. So he use the dough hook once you have the ball of dough. Okay, that's fair. You you do you do that. I feel like an absolute child right now. This is Lauren's croissant thing. That one well, in the way, sorry. I will. Oh, if I remember to, I'm not lazy. But then again, I'm always ignoring my calc homework anyway, so it wouldn't be that, that big of a deal. That is true. <laughs> okay. Experience that firsthand. Yeah, I think I heard about that. Yeah, she's cutting up. She's doing that thing. The butter's sticking at the table. Yeah, you know, but it's like, the butter's like sticking at the table. That's the big now. issue. Like, look at all that. It's like... Just, just shut up, Devin, okay? It's like sticking at the table. Just shush. It's sticking go everywhere. Away. It's sticking everywhere. Why don't you go bug in? Go away. <laughs> yeah. They'll throw you in Wakefield. No, that'd be cold. Yeah. I mean, you're technically my ride home, so. <laughs> that's a good no, that's point. A... Yeah, you don't want to argue. No, that's, that's <laughs> you don't want to aggravate the person. Home. Yeah, that's a good point. Your dough is actually looking pretty nice so far. And then let's see how Leo's doing. What? Oh, I'm just making sure it's rising, okay? It's very dark dough. Because yeah. I think that's from the coffee. Must be. Doesn't look terrible, it could have looked a lot worse, you know. Yeah, I'm honestly surprised with coffee in it. I think it's doing okay. Okay, so here's the part where it all goes to shit again, right? I know, second time, like, come on, really, already? Yeah, it gets pretty heated, quite literally, to the point where uh, I had, we had to open up the windows, because it was that bad. The windows? This is not good, okay, currently, I don't know if you can see this, there's a lot of smoke, and if you open this baby up... Oh, yeah, so that's Lauren, that's mine, that's... Uh, Leo's and that's Alex's, but it is smoking on it. I think it's those it coffee beans. Parchment paper touching the wall of the oven. Is that my olive oil? Parchment paper, yeah, didn't want to keep that on the right. seat. And you're yeah, the one who slid it off. Okay, so then there could be one of three things. Yeah, it could be my the fact that I put tons of olive yeah, oil in there. It could be yeah, the that, coffee yeah, that beans. Twenty years old. It could also be the parchment paper okay. burning. I would take it out. It opened the window. Okay. The yeah. Who would have thunk it? It was actually the parchment paper. It was not the olive oil or the other thing. It was actually the parchment paper because they decided to use a crap ton of parchment paper and it caught fire in the oven. It, it, it could be... Paper, Hang on, let me smell that real quick. That could it be the olive oil. It might be our olive oil because it would put a lot, quite it, a bit. It does have a low like, flash point. Yeah it, does, uh, yeah, it does have a low burning uh, point. So That's not good. Yeah. Not the that's the smoke point. The flash point's next. Cause that's that's why I put it in a uh, like a, a pan so it wouldn't like go everywhere. It's all beneath the down under beneath the thing of something. So what did we learn today, folks? Parchment paper burns well, like a oh, mother yeah. trucker. Oh, you know, paper can be, uh, yeah, who knew paper was uh, very flammable? Who knew that? Who knew that? Who this thought? Is actually, I will say, who moved the parchment paper over? 
I mean, you had to move this over so they were pissed off. No, no, Alex, this is so our fault. This is both of your guys' fault, yeah. yeah. I mean, it was me who told you to move it over, so... You're yeah, the one who actually did move it over. <laughs> you can trim this bit, too, I'd say. You, I'm doing what we're gonna do. We're gonna take that on this. That's and, probably and, smart. And yeah. Just, like... Andrew, what is that in the air fryer? <laughs> oh, Mark, is there mine on there? <laughs> that is, that is like one of them so precarious. Like, it's like bleeding over to the side. Wait, okay, we don't want to set that on fire either. Oh, uh, don't mess up the Yeah, there's so much oh, paper in there. Sorry. There goes the <laughs> No, not the <laughs> Distracted me. That's mine. Now remember what I said before about Andrew's bread? Yeah, so the the first bread he made, the trashy one, not the one that you saw spinning around dangerously in the, uh, the machine earlier. Uh, yeah, he stuck that in the air fryer at a very interesting angle, and uh, he set a timer for it, but he didn't set the temperature. So the thing was just sitting in there for like a half hour before we actually noticed that the heat wasn't on at all. Hey was guys, awesome. move! I've got a hot thing. All right. <laughs> you know. <laughs> I mean, I am right here. What's up here? See, this is why I think we should cook instead of bake next time. We'll figure something out. Baking is. Fun. I'm more of a chef than I am a baker. I talked about this. Well, generally, I, I don't put that many loaves of bread in the oven at once, but, uh... Yeah. I was cheating on something. Oh, I did. Wasn't this supposed to be, like, the actual bread one? Yeah. yeah. That's it's not, not turning like, out well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you have fun with that. Alright, you know the pizza that isn't ours, but we have a new contestant now. Uh -oh. This is Ben. What are you doing? I've been recording this entire time. On and off, on and off, and I'm gonna. Uh, I if I plan to, uh, I hopefully I remember to edit this all all this together. So <laughs> Ben was gonna pull up a recipe, but we stopped him. So <laughs> he's winging it. This is. He's trying. He's doing okay. <laughs> Half cup of yeast water. How big is this scoop, Alex? What? How about a big cup? Is this scoop? It's That's a like cup? a cup. Third of a cup. Oh, you're in a pen to our documentary? Yeah. Half cup, okay. I'm ben, just doing, eyeball it. I'm doing a one to two ratio. Wait, Ben. Huh? Yeah. Never mind. What? Never mind. What? Don't nothing. Nothing. Just you keep going. Me, oh, figure it out! And now you're like, oh, just by the going. way! Just keep going. <laughs> I don't even know what to do. You got this one. No, don't worry. No, because you got, you got it. See? I don't know how it's done. Okay, I might need more. You probably didn't. This isn't enough. Yeah. Okay, it's all on my fingers. A little bit at a time, I'd say. Just don't put too much. That's all I'm going to tell you. And over here, we have and oh, excuse me. I don't know if I trust you, but I'll take it out. My God, he's holding a knife. So this is this yours? Yeah. Right. Oh, do you know the toothpick trick? <laughs> what? The toothpick uh, trick. Stick a toothpick inside your dough, inside your bread, and maybe if it comes out clean. with a knife. Why is that look green? Huh? If it comes out clean, like that, it should be Why good. Why does it look green? Because there's a green light. I think it's green. good. I'm gonna take it out. Okay. Yeah. So this is Andrew's pretzel thing. Oh, he's yeah. actually boiling it. And uh, uh, how am I gonna get it out? Without, maybe I could just grab the bread. You could try. You might burn your hands. Oh wait, I have an idea. Where's that knife, Alex? I have to do everything. Uh, uh, where did I put that? Oh, it's right over there. Why? There's a knife. No. no. That actually might. Oh, be you might know. Ruin your crumb. Yeah, you ruined your crumb, dude. You're yeah, gonna ruin you'll your ruin crumb. Your crumb. Yeah. You have to let it rest. I can spat like a pizza. Where's I wouldn't pizza? put that down. I really hope this isn't enough yeast to like occupy the entire oven. <laughs> you can't even like get it out. Yeah, you can't even 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 get it out. Yeah, you can not even get it out yeah 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 you can I'm just trying Dude, to get out yet. Like I gotta get take a out. picture. You have to let it rest. Yeah, now you gotta let it rest. Andrew. Yeah, you can set it on the counter.
She goes with the prettiest looking one, of course. But do you need water for like a palate cleanser? What? They should drink something in between to like wash it out. Don't worry, we got that. Okay. I need to cleanse my palate. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, careful. The crispiness of this. Oh, okay. What they say? Um, it's dry. It's, it's really dry. <laughs> like the salt is really yummy. I like the texture of the inside. Because I like the doughy inside. You can tell by my pizza cookie. Yeah. <laughs> um, it tastes good. It's just really good. I don't know where you're getting doughy. I want to try the meat. All right. The meat? I want to try the meat. You tried raw, it's worse, probably. That should never be said during a bread tasting. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Uh, I gotta finish showing the last one. <laughs> <laughs> this, you're gonna like this one. It's really doughy. But I do really enjoy the crust. Ah. Does it taste like vegan turkey? I've never had that. But probably. <laughs> In my mind, so far, this looks like well. Based on what? In like uh, your texture bread. and taste. They should try the raw version next. I don't taste much. I'm trying the raw one now. We might get sick. <laughs> <laughs> but we're going to try it anyway. Moving on to that one. It's a very crispy crust. <laughs> oh, um, are they on the upper right one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah the upper left. Oh, yeah. The raw one. Upper left? Yeah. The, this the is lacking flavor and texture <laughs> and visual <laughs> appeal. Mm -hmm. I disagree. The texture it is great. It, is, yeah, it definitely <laughs> needed some baking time of some sort. <laughs> <laughs> right. Are these two the same? Yeah. This yeah. looks like beautiful bread. Yeah. Like it does. <laughs> it smells good. It's a little doughy. You probably like it a lot. Kind of need a little bit of butter. I'm blocking away. I'm no. blocking on the outer crust. <laughs> I like the acidity of it. <laughs> Acid? What is this music? He's is just someone pulling squeeze? Okay. business <laughs> off the Food Network because all these doing now. I was like, I don't know where putting mm -hmm. lemon on that. That one's pretty good. Yeah, That'd be good with... Uh, Are you going to shoot uh, them if they eat yours? <laughs> but, Are these two the same? Yeah, yeah. they should be the same We're, as well. We did two of each. Okay. Uh, We've had this one before. This one's going to keep me up tonight. <laughs> <laughs> but That's the like coffee one, yeah. Really I feel like good. you're going to think about it all night long. <laughs> um, it's consensus. All right, well, in my opinion. Wait, have you tried the like ones in the middle there? Like, yeah, they're they're not, like, Are they the same? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. The ones what? for... What? Yeah. Oh, oh wait, those. we have a side yeah. Yeah, you guys. Those? Yeah. 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 Those. Wait a minute. Those are we thought we thought they were um, <laughs> straps. They, they are someone's <laughs> someone's present. Yeah. Garnish. Okay. Oh my god! First yeah. of all, this isn't fair. I got the coffee taste in my mouth. I should have done that coffee tea last. I mean, it is sparkling water. I, mean, I think I'm gonna go after this. <laughs> Say something. Sorry. <laughs> <All right. laughs> <laughs> they got to chew a lot. <laughs> <laughs>
I'd take another bite, but then I couldn't judge because I'd be taught or chewing. I give a lot of credit. I'm going to go personally for me. Creativity goes with the coffee bread. That, that's just, I mean, I think that that could be taken somewhere in a slightly different direction, but <laughs> something could be made of that idea. And if I'm going to go back for one, it's got to be the croissant. I think the croissant is really, the, really good. The texture of it, like it's all, it's missing a little bit like the flavor of a, of a traditional croissant, but the texture of it is like kind of like I want the crispiness and the, and the flakiness of it. I really right. love it. I mean, I like the croissant also. I like this one. The meat was good. Yep. The ones that look most like red are the top two, and I'll go with you for that, that coffee the, one. That is the prettiest. Yep. What's your opinion on that one? That one? It's like, it has to go um, back in the oven, and then we should Back in the again. 70s, there was this toy, and you just stretched him, and you're like, <laughs> <laughs> right right that. Yes. Yep. <laughs> so what if we told you that that cooked one you ate was the same one as the one in the top left? This one? Yeah, that yeah, one, the one on the top left. Oh, you fried it or something? Well, yeah. that was a good thing to do with it. I am so surprised. How did it? <laughs> you hate this one, but you like the toast. Yes. Well, it's oh. more done. It is. It's got this great roundness to it. Unbelievable. Like, who doesn't love textures, well, everything? You have to keep in mind, it looks like meat. It's that bread. <laughs> yes, I would say it is definitely. Look that. I want it. Are you sure it is not a slice of turkey? You guys need new parents. <laughs> what? And I'd also like to say that that's toast. No, toast is bread. Well, no, a hundred percent. You cannot make it's toast It's double cooked bread. bread. Yeah. All right. Who made uh, these ones? Me. You did. Yeah. That's your your okay. meat toast. Yeah. Bread. My meat bread. Yes. Your meat bread. That's a different. Who made meat? the croissants? That was me. That was really good. Those are beautiful. Who made the pies? I made those. I didn't hate the pie. I actually, I didn't hate any of them. No, I hope the olive oil, yeah. Surprisingly, they were... It's the olive oil. Just I just put a crap ton, uh, yeah. yeah. I actually haven't eaten any of the toasted. I toasted this up as the well, experiment. The texture is that crispy part is really... Who awesome. made this one? Hello, Tony. Nice job. That one Tony. really looks that, like a loaf of bread. It does. That's, that's, a, that's, that's the most that is bread bread like. pretty, Oh, that's... Is that... No. <laughs> Wait a minute. He's still got his bread. No, he's he's a, a, we made two things. Oh. Yes, uh, I was going to say, that who, who, who is the the he, air fries, he air fried a bowl of bread and ripped it up and put it on the air. Okay, yeah, that, that's, <laughs> that's, that's absolute shit. <laughs> 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 it looks like it's creator. Yeah, that's, no, not even a little bit like it's creator. You agreed for a second. Like the Your the pretzel is beautiful. The pretzel is very lovely, yeah. There's some um, queso in there if you guys want to dip. Oh yeah, there is. Well, he's rubbed on his face. I don't know. Oh, no, he took a whiff. Keep your face off it. Of yes. For the idea, because truly, I think this isn't the end. Well, this actually, isn't the end it was because my hands were covered in dough and I couldn't turn the sink on, so I just poured some coffee in. <laughs> I would have went without the beans and done ground coffee. Well, but the beans on top, just to show you, like, yeah. they do it, you know, Canary, you go, Eric, you know, and much. you can tell what their bread is by what they do to it, how it's cut. They all know what the, each bread is because they yeah. do a certain thing to it. I think it's something you definitely eat, like, for top. brunch or something. And like people that. do eat, right, I think it could be perfected into a really interesting thing. Because coffee bread's Dude, a thing. When, no, you get, when you get your job at Starbucks, you should, like, coffee introduce coffee that cake. to them. Yes. Yes. yes, coffee cake. Yeah, that's what I was thinking of the whole time. Right? Right? Except for, you know, there's cinnamon and sugar in that. Yeah, they call true. it that because you can eat it with coffee. I think you guys yes. need to bring a sample mm -hmm. to all But your wouldn't it be a fun little... Um, we also have big chunks. A fun yeah. little play on that. Oh, yeah. To call it, you know, coffee bread or coffee cake. But there's actually coffee in it. Like, if you're a coffee place, that would be a fun idea. And say, no, we put your caffeine in your in your carbohydrates. Because who doesn't want that? Carbohydrates. What do you go around with? <laughs> <laughs> Hold your pretzel. Uh, so, 
You know why this looks like this? No, because you didn't bake it long enough. No, it was baking for the longest of all of them. Because I needed to do a ball roast, I forgot yeast. Poured in yeast oh, water, then oh, remixed it up. Yeah, I heard the story about that, and that's... Do you guys know about yeast and how it has to bloom, and then yeah. you add salt, and then you add your flour, and like, this is all bread. Yeast is a science. Baking is a science. Well, I put some sugar, some flour, and water, mixed okay. it together into a really goopy mess. And oh, I don't even know about sugar, dude. Mm. I should put some sugar in with the yeast. A uh, yeah. Maybe that's what you I don't ever well, put I, well, maybe a little. A, bit, yeah, a, little, a tablespoon a little of sugar. sugar. You do a little bit of salt. Sugar, salt mm. Some water, some yeast. Give it some, yeah. some warm water. Let it bloom. Then you start adding your flour and the rest of it. Yeah, I think that's why mine was so yeah, dense. Right, you guys all <laughs> go to Cobb and make us a steak. <laughs> I, I, mean, I can do that. I can do that. I can do that. Too. I, 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 I,